guys welcome to the channel this is Hamza in today's video I'm actually picking up my G-Wagon after I got a little work done at Brave Motorsports right here in Houston sorry my phone's ringing stuff's ringing which is busy but uh, we're gonna pick up the G-Wagon I'm gonna show it to you oh it's looking pretty awesome I can actually see it right now well, look what I see look what I see it's all fixed it's all better now it was a little damaged but it's all better now actually believe it or not the shop it's looking quite empty compared to what it used to be. Anyways, let's see what's done on the G-Wagon. Yeah, so we're here with the guys at Brave Motorsports. We're just picking up the G-Wagon. We're gonna take a look at a couple of their cool rides and meet the crew. So I drove in with this, and obviously, as you guys can see, that's really not where the action's at. I think the action's somewhere else, and we're gonna go take a look at that in a second. So we're picking up the G-Wagon, but in the meantime, look at some of these awesome projects that they have. Uh, and that they're working on. This is some like really cool next level stuff. Like this is not your normal off-roading, you know, gear. Look at that. That's like roll cage center. And that's like, you know, they have quite a lot of bit of gear. Um, and we're gonna get to talk and see what exactly they did to some of these trucks. All right, here's Dave from Brave Motorsports. And Dave, man, tell us, you got some awesome, awesome rides here. What, what's going on with this? Is this a side-by-side -side yeah, or? so this is a Arctic Cat Wildcat that we built for King of the Hammers back in 2014. And uh, the good customers bought it and uh, we're putting it back together and hope, hopefully go race it uh, in 2021. It's King of the Hammers out in, out in California. Okay. That's pretty awesome. This is high speed stuff. I'm yeah, assuming. it's. Uh, this is yeah, not your crawler. Well, well, no. I mean, it's desert racing and rock racing. Okay. So it's okay. you're racing through the desert from rock trail to rock trail. So it's okay. the hardest one day race in the world. Wow, that's um, crazy. A couple hundred miles worth of rocks and, and desert, and so yeah, it's either kind of have to do it all. Okay. Well, that's pretty insane. Let's go take a look at it, man, real quick. Yeah. All right, Dave, you got, I see you got that Jeep there in the corner. Yeah. Walk me through it, man. That's, that ride looks sick. Two different customers, a very, very similar build. Okay. Uh, this is a uh, 2006 Jeep uh, LJ Unlimited. Uh, we've done the... Airline. So what's, what's an LJ? Uh, LJ is a TJ, but longer. Okay, okay. Uh, she's a Wrangler. So, okay. Uh, you know, if you got kids or whatever, you can, you can put them in the back. Um, this has got the Genrite Tracer kit. Wow. on it which is relatively new um, Cur curry uh, dana 16 uh, rock jack 70 in the back yeah. 32 inch bfg cr crawlers on 20 inch trail ready bay lock wow. um, okay this is the technical stuff so i'm looking at that diff is that the dana 60 you're talking yeah, about the front cur curry 60 um so this thing's all like one ton spec, getting big, wow. big, big, nasty low wood, six piston brakes off of uh, off the trophy truck. It's got a um, 525 horse LS3 in it. Oh, that's a Corvette engine. Uh, yep. Um, bolted up to a 4L80 wow. trans. Okay. That's a 2500 trans, right? Um, 4L80s? Or are they the newer six speed? No, so this is the four speed, correct. Okay. Just lots and lots of goodies. Shocks by ADS Racing Shocks. Yeah, looks good. Is so, that yeah. is that a catch or is that for this power steering? No, or? that's the power steering. It's got a, it's got a PSC. So yeah, a lot of uh, you know a lot of badass, uh, yeah. almost race car parts on it. This looks uh, like race car stuff yeah, right a, here. Is that like big, billet or big, yeah, custom big, bracketry? Big wow, look at like that. Is it all all wheel with brakes? It's a Ron Davis radiator. And headers? Is, are these long tube or, um, yeah, or are they shorties? Kind of re relatively long. Nah, I mean, they're, I'd say they're kind of more mid length. It's, it's, okay. not, real, it's not realistic to get um, long tubes. It should breathe pretty well. Okay. Uh, the Genrite mm -hmm. kit makes all this stuff easy. It's, it comes with a radiator, it comes with motor mount, it comes with all the suspension. Uh, this is all Gen Genrite armor. Okay. Genrite laser fit cage. It's not super straightforward, but it's, it's about as straightforward as you're going to get on a build of this. <laughs> level yeah um this one here is uh it's a very similar build uh same almost the same components it's a 525 for ls3 dana 60 actually have a gm 14 bolt in the back of it um but we hand built this thing okay um, so this we built this before all the tracer stuff was out so kind of along the same lines um but it's taken us a lot longer to build this because like i said it's all hand built we we, we built the exhaust here uh, we built every bit of this thing. 
So you built you you guys built these custom manifolds yeah, in house. Wow. Are you those MSD see, wires? Yes. Yeah. You can't see the sheet metal work on here right now, but we did a lot of uh, custom aluminum tin work on it. And, um, it's uh, in fact the cage you looked at a moment ago. That's, that's yeah. this thing. Okay. Uh, this thing is uh, actually it's actually race legal and street legal. So wow. If you want to go race this thing, you can see the hammers you, you could. Uh, we also got blinkers and wipers and everything to go down the street. Yeah, that looks awesome. And the engine is the same LS3? Yep, 525 horse, straight LS3 to a... Uh, are you guys doing crate motors or is this... Uh... Yeah, these are both crate motors. Okay. Typically, that's what we do. Um, you know, they have a warranty on them. They're, they're reliable, they're powerful. Some, some of the higher dollar race cars get, uh, you know, get bigger engines. We have, a, we have another Ultra 4 race car here that's got a big LME. Uh, okay. 775 boards. Yeah. LSX in it. Um, and it has the same Curry 60 like the other truck? Uh, this is actually, no, this is out of a uh, Ford uh, F250. Wow. Okay. Front. Yeah. Eight bolt? Yep, eight lug yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 That's crazy. Got the keys to my Jeep. Yeah. 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 Yeah.